Hi, Dollar Tree friends. Welcome back to my page. Um, again, I am Andrea with um, Thrifting Junkie um, is my page. And um, I'm going to be doing a lot of Dollar Tree hauls. I'm going to start doing some Goodwill um, hauls. And um, we'll see where it goes from there. I have enjoyed doing the last couple of videos. Um, I hope that some more people will start seeing my page. And um, as we go along, I'll get better at doing this. Um, but um, I just wanted to let y'all know that I have quite a bit of stuff. I went to two Dollar Trees. Um, I've kind of separated it so that I can do um, beauty products and then I can do like home items, um, a few crafts, and then food. Um, none of this is from my local Dollar Tree um, just because I was out of town the end of last week and um, I went to two Dollar Trees while I was going out of town. And so now I wanted to go ahead and give you the haul. So let's get busy. All right, so the first thing that I want to show you today is I came across these Bolero um, products that are in these cool little envelopes. Um, the first one is all avocado oil. Um, again, it's by Bolero. Um, I got these at the Dollar Tree. It says for all skin types, concentrated formula targets acne prone skin for smooth results. I thought maybe my daughter could use this. She is allergic to a lot of things. Um, but being that it's avocado oil, she should be okay. It's mainly like the silic acid type um, products that she can't use. So I went ahead and grabbed one of these. I love how these are in these packages. Um, they just look really, um, they look really, really fancy. Um, so I got that. Then I found a brightening cream that says um for all skin types look awake and refreshed with a burst of concentrated hydration it's argan oil i'm going to try this i want to see how this works um, because i need some brightness this one is jojoba i don't know if you can read that j-o-j-o-b-a oil um, but this is a surge of moisture helps reduce redness for that healthy glow so again i need this then I got another one for my daughter because it's coconut oil. This is enriched with vitamin E for super smooth, clean skin. This is a jelly um, facial balm that she can use. And again, um, it says that it's coconut oil, so she shouldn't have any type of allergic reaction. Um, this one actually, I'm sorry, this is a face mask. And then of course the eye cream and then the um, milk serum. I just thought these were really good, um, good packaging, good quality. Um, so I just wanted to see how, how they work. Um, the next thing I got is I've been seeing um, a lot of, I got in my last haul just the face sponges from my local Dollar Tree, but I found these Echo Tools Color Perfecting Minis. Um, at one of the Dollar Trees that I went to out of town. It says color perfecting minis, best with color correcting sealers, made with eco foam technology, um, tree free, paper free. Um, they've been recycled, um, they're cruelty free. So um, I'm really liking these Echo tools. And then I got a contouring, a contouring um, perfecter applicator is what it says, best with bronzers and highlighters. Um, my daughter does a lot of makeup. I don't really do much makeup, um, but I thought that these were were nice um, tools to apply makeup on. And then the last product that I got was Echo Tools. Is I grabbed two, one for her and one for me. These are the Muslim um, polishing cloths. Um, they're designed with organic cotton to open pores and remove dirt, oil, makeup for fresh and revived skin. So I thought these were really nice. Um, I haven't looked these up. Um, but I've heard that you can get these at Ulta and um, Target, places like that. But um, so I got these four for a dollar each. You cannot beat that. There's no way that these go for probably less than, you know, four or five dollars at um, Target or Ulta. So I also got this coconut chapstick. I like, I like the coconut. Um, formula it's coconut oil formula coconut oil lip balm by palmers um i got two of them i don't really know why the packages are different 
but um, I got two of them. They are 15 SPF, which I really enjoy um, taking to the beach with me. So I figured I could throw one in my beach bag and then have the other um, for everyday use. But um, I like to have one in my beach bag so that I can um, apply it while I'm in the sun. Um, I picked up bandages, band-aids. Band-aids are a great thing to get at the Dollar Tree. These are the regular small band-aids. They have the big um, elbow pad bandages, the knee scraping bandages for a dollar. You can't, you can't get band-aids any cheaper than that. Um, I did find some um, Dove Nourishing Body Cream made by Dove, which I love Dove soap. Um, I got the pink one the other day in the haul that I um, did that I posted earlier. Um, but I always open them. I just make sure that the film is, is securely wrapped so that um, they haven't been opened before. But this one I know smells great. So I got that. I got two different kinds of shave creams. This one is the Pure Silk Coconut. I got this for my daughter. I figured she would like that um, coconut scent. And then this one is Personal Care Super Smooth Shave Shave Cream. This is pomegranate and raspberry. And it comes with a little pump top um, for myself. So I grabbed those shave creams, which are great. Um, I did get her some more dry shampoo um, in my haul that I did um, the first one. I got um, her some dry shampoo. She had never used it. Um, before and she was wanting to try it. it smelled really good but she did use it she said she liked it so I saw this is a little bit different of one I think it's a different scent but I grabbed it for a dollar and then I also got her Noxzema brand face wash I figured she could use that that shouldn't break her out um, then the I got her one of these facial cleansing brushes by um, Sassy and Chic She's been wanting one of these. Um, we've seen them at Bell's Outlet. We've seen them at Target. And, um, you know, they're 15 bucks or so. But I figure this would be nice to get her to use to see if she likes it. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry. Um, it comes with these bristles, the little head of it. The bristles, they're pretty soft. They're not, they're not going to be rough on her, I don't think. Um, so I figure she could use these. It's battery operated. So, we'll see how she likes it. And um, then, you know, we can always go to, to TJ Maxx or to Bell's Outlet and, and get her the other one. But I figure for now, you know, that would be great. Oh, excuse me. Let's give me some sweet tea. All right. So, the, the one of the last things that I got in the beauty um, area were these little socks. Um, these have little characters on them. Um, this one has a little dog, um, but they're super soft. These do not have the no grip, the no slip grips, um, but I love, I love using these. Um, a lot of times every, you know, morning I'll put them on, um, especially in the winter when it's cold, um, hardwood floors get kind of chilly. So, um, I love having these on hand. They're really soft. Um, and that's it for the beauty products. So, um, the next thing I'm going to start out with is the food. Um, I got my daughter, I don't know if you can see this, this is Nestle, Nestle water. They come in a package like this, six of them, I don't know if you can see, six in a pack. Um, this one is the lemon, she has drank all but two, this one and another one was in the refrigerator, so I just grabbed it because I wanted to show you, um, but this one is the berry, she actually, um, I got her two packs of the berry. Um, she's already opened the berry and is drinking it as well. She says they're good. Um, I know that you can buy flavored water at Walmart, and I think they're, you know, three bucks or something, two, two dollar, two fifty, but a dollar. You cannot beat that for a dollar. Um, I'm gonna have to go back and get her some more because she is just drinking them up. So that is it for that. So let's start with the food. Um, most of these are all name brand things that you can get. Um, I want to start off with these because I did do these in another haul. These are Chips Ahoy cookies. Um, I went ahead and grabbed three of these because my daughter loved them. My fiance loved them. Um, so I grabbed three. Um, let's see. In case you missed my other haul, they actually have um, Sour Patch Kids morsels. And they're called Chips Ahoy Sour Patch Kids. When I first bought these, I'm not going to lie, y'all. 
listen, this hair is dark, but there's blonde in it. I thought there was Sour Patch Kids in with the chocolate chip cookies. And I was like, oh, that's not going to be good. But it's not. It's Sour Patch flavored morsels in the cookie. And uh, my daughter said they taste a lot like key lime pie. So she really liked them. We went through those two packs quickly. Um, so I grabbed three more of those. And then I grabbed these. I love these um, emeralds. These are um, cashews. Um, emerald brand. Of course, name brand. Um, these are the salt and pepper cashews. I love to throw these in my purse. I love to throw these in my beach bag. Um, I am a snacker. I am a true <laughs> snacker. If I could live my life just snacking all day, I would. Um, so, I mean, I love having things like this um, to just grab and go. These at the convenience store are at least a buck fifty. So you're saving fifty cents. You know, if you buy enough of these, that's gonna add up. These are so worth it for a dollar. And I know most Dollar Trees have these in sriracha flavor or jalapeno flavor. There is original. Um, I can't think offhand other flavors, but I know they have the jalapeno and the sriracha. Um, but these are the salt and pepper. They're really good. I love them. Um I got this. I, I hadn't seen this at a dollar, oh, dollar Tree before. Sorry. Um, this is Hungry Jack Original Hash Brown Potatoes. Um, so they're dried. They're like dehydrated potatoes. And then you add water and it um, does its thing. And then you fry them up like hash browns. Um, I have had these a long time ago. But I had never seen these at the Dollar Tree for a dollar. Great breakfast. Um, something different. So I figured why not. Um, let's look at the chips that we got. The first thing was this Chex Mix. This is the traditional flavor. Again, name brand Chex Mix. This at Walmart is $3 probably. Um, and I got it for a dollar. It's, full, it's a full size bag. Full size. So you, you cannot beat that for a dollar. Um, I did find two kinds of chips that I had not seen. Um, I'd seen the TGI Fridays, the ones that look like potato skins. But these were actually a little different. Um, this first one is mozzarella sticks. It says original baked TGF Friday's mozzarella sticks. Um, there's 25% more in this bag. This is this is a big bag. It's a big bag for a dollar. So I just thought that they would be good to try from TGF Friday's. And they had a second flavor um, buffalo ranch. And these are party bites. So, I thought they would be good. It says premium puffed corn snacks in Buffalo Ranch flavor. Um, so, why not? For a dollar, it's a great snack. Um, I did find Italian breadcrumbs. This is a big can. This is a big can. This is 13 ounces, Italian style. I'm telling you, you cannot tell the difference between this and the one that you get at Walmart. The, I think it's progresso or something like that these taste just as good dust them on some chicken breasts um, i put this in my meatloaf love it love it and it, it's a dollar you can't beat that um i found new york bakery the original texas toast croutons garlic and butter these are so good from the dollar tree i, I don't think i had seen them at the dollar tree before but um so i got those um, I grabbed these Idaho potatoes, mashed potatoes. Um, I don't use these a lot. I mean, a lot of times, uh, most of the time I make homemade mashed potatoes. But when you're in a hurry, a dollar. This is a family size pack. And when I tell you this makes quite a bit, this, this makes quite a bit. Um, we, we can eat off of these. Um, and then I got... These little um, crackers, I love having crackers around. I like having crackers and cheese, crackers and hummus. Um, these are Toast Originals. And if you can really see, they almost look like a bagel chip. Let's see if you can see that better. Um, but I bought these so that I could have, um, you know, put some cheese, sliced up cheese on it. Some, you know, you could do some sliced up ham, turkey. Um, and then hummus would be great. Um, oh, this is try with fruit jam, ham and cheese, butter, and salmon. I'm not going to do the salmon, but. Um, I found the Suddenly Salad Pasta Bacon Ranch for a dollar. 
Um, so I, I figured that I would try it out. Um, this is by Betty Crocker, so name brand again. Um, the quick little little dish that um, you can make up as a side, um, quick and easy. I found these milk drinks by Hershey's Chocolate Milk. They're 2% reduced fat, um, but I grabbed these for my daughter. She loves chocolate milk, um, and this would be something that she can grab and take with her or, um, you know, can sit in the cabinet until she's ready to have it and then can put it in the fridge for a little while and get it cold. Um, then this, I actually got the cake, um, ones of these in my last haul that I had on, um, here. These are actually hot fudge brownie mug treats. And these are also by Betty Crocker. Um, these are actually fudge brownies that you make in the coffee mug. And it has this packet of Hershey topping chocolate. Um, so I mean, I figured those would be great. Um, says it takes about one minute to um, make and it serves one person per one pouch mix and topping so I grabbed two of those I haven't tried the cake ones yet but I'm gonna I'm gonna try these um, these I got in the last haul as well um, these are the sea salt and vinegar chips I went ahead and grabbed two because you cannot beat the size of these bags of chips for a dollar for three of them um, so I did go ahead and grab those so that we would have them in the cabinet stocked up. Again, those you can throw in your in your um, bag to go to the beach. You can throw them in your car. Um, so just good, good little grabs. All right, so let me show you what I got for the kitchen. Um, I, I'm not gonna put these out yet. Right now I have um, 4th of July stuff out and then I'm gonna be putting out some watermelon stuff. But um, these I thought were so cute with the the truck with the chicken, so cute, and they had the matching matching towel. So I grabbed those. I just thought they were too cute. Um, a lot of times I'll put these up just as decorations um, in the kitchen, but I thought those were so cute. Um, oh, wash rags too, with the little chicken on top. Can't really see it there, but. But um, these are good little washcloths, so for a dollar, you can't beat that. Um, I did find these by Brillo. I had not seen these before. Um, these are gloves for you to, like, wash dishes. Um, you could use them if you're cleaning the toilet, cleaning the shower, whatever you want to use them for. But they're super long. They're super long, and they're pretty. They're so cute. Um... So it says one size fits all, reusable gloves, texture grip, multi-purpose. Um, these do have latex in it, so be careful if you have a latex allergy. Um, I grabbed some some more scissors for the kitchen by Betty Crocker. Um, I love all their, their spoons and things like that. Um, so I grabbed those. Then I grabbed these. I wanted to replace my wooden utensils um, that I use in the kitchen every day. Uh, I've had, I bought these about a year and a half ago for the kitchen and i've been using them for a year and a half they're still in decent shape um but i just wanted to go ahead and re replace them um but that the spatula and then these these two spatulas and this spoon are the ones that i currently have and i found these two so i thought i would add these to the two to the collection as well i had not seen these before but um, I did, I went ahead and, you know, got all five of them. Um, I love them. They're bamboo, bamboo spoons. They hold up great. Um, I don't use the dishwasher. I hand wash the dishes, so I don't know how they would handle um, the dishwasher. Um, the last thing I got for the house is this Reynolds Wrap sheets. Um, I use full sheets a lot of times when I'm baking chicken or, or you know, any kind of thing that I'm baking. Um, I like to, it, is, it makes for easy cleanup, so I go ahead and grab these and figure why not. Great for leftovers, wrapping up sandwiches, so much more. Um, 25 sheets for a dollar. You can't beat it, and I figured I'd try them out. Um, so that is all the things for the house that I got. I'm going to show you the arts and crafts things that I got really quickly. I got these stars to decorate with. They're cute. Red, white, and blue. I think I'm going to put these all either on the center table of my table 
or I have the three tiered shelf that I could put them on as well. I'm not really sure. We'll see. Um, these wood blocks to paint. There is two, four, six of these wood planks. They had them in rectangle and they had them square. I had never seen the square ones. So I went ahead and grabbed them. You know, you, you can do all kinds of things, paint with these. Um, and then I grabbed some paint brushes from the Dollar Tree because I love to paint. So there are those. And then the last thing that I want to show you is just some things that I got for myself just because, um, you know, things that I can use at work, um, use at home, those sort of things, office supplies. Um, so I found these little, where's the other one? There it is. I found these little notepads. I thought they were so cute. This one says coffee time and it looks like a little coffee. And then here's this one. This one looks like a travel coffee mug and it says coffee loves you. It is so cute. Um, they do have the magnet on the back so you can hang them on your fridge. I will probably take these to work with me um, and use them, but I love sticky notes. <laughs> I can't remember anything. Um, I found this little um, notepad. It says it's the little things in life. The little pen comes attached and it flips. The spirals at the top, it flips. So you can keep notes, anything like that you want to. And I just thought it was pretty. It has like cactuses on it. So I love that. Um, I grabbed me some pens. I love using different kinds of pens. So I went ahead and grabbed these pens. These are the all blue gel pens. And then these are just colored um, blue, orange, and green that might be red got those and then for my glasses because these things like to stay dirty um i got this is um, a clean, cleansing cloth but there's two of them they actually sold these um one of them was um a more rectangular package and it just had one cloth this had two cloths two but when i took this one out I mean it's it's really big it's not like it's super small I mean that's plenty big enough I don't know how big the other one is I didn't take it out of the package but that's plenty big enough for my glasses so I can keep one you know home one here one at work um, and then I got these lens wipes figure I could take some of these to work with me to clean the glasses all this for a dollar y'all um, and then speaking of my glasses I grabbed, I grabbed um, these little eyeglass pouches. I thought this was super cute for the summertime with the um, pineapples and the cherries and the flamingos. But it just opens up and it's, it's soft in there. You can take your glasses off. Take your glasses off. Pop them right in. Safe spot. I like to take my glasses off and throw them around everywhere. So I um, thought that would be good. And then look at this one. This one is adorable. It says Hello Summer and it looks like a watermelon. So cute. Um, so what's probably going to happen is I'm going to take my glasses off, put them inside, set it down, and I'm not going to be able to find my glasses. I'm going to be looking everywhere for them. Um, and, and I'm going to have to remember, oh yeah, you got a case to put them in. Um, so this was really um, cute. I was hoping I would find these when I went to the Dollar Tree. But um, these are the satin pillowcases. This one says good morning. And this one says good night. Um, both of these say good night. I got one for my daughter. And then um, a good morning and a good night for my bed. Um, but these are so cute. Let me sh I just want to show you how cute these are. Um, they're really soft satin. Um, but look at this. It says good night and it has the sleepy little eyes they are so precious for a dollar you cannot beat that for a dollar um and the other one says good morning so i thought that one would be cute let me show you it really fast if i can get it open duh andrea it opens at the bottom so silly so silly i only have a couple more things guys i know this video is getting long uh, but this one says, good morning. Good morning. And it's satin. 
satin pillowcase for a dollar. You just can't beat that. That is so cute. Um, so the last, the last two things that I have to show you are, are a couple books. This is a totally buff book. It says it is by Libby Babbitt and the Buff Girls. It says Six Week Guide to Becoming Beautiful, Unstoppable, and Fearless. Um, I got this. I looked through it, and it has some really pretty cool um, recipes. It has some workout videos. Like, look at that. It looks delicious. That is beef satay stir fry. Just show some different kinds of recipes that you can make for a dollar. Look how thick this book is. For a dollar. This sold in the U.S. for $19.99 before it went to the Dollar Tree. And I got it for a dollar. Can't beat it. Um, then I got this. This is called Crayoligraphy. I thought this was really cute because when you open it up, has all these black pages that you can doodle on. You can get the Crayola metallic markers. But it also teaches you how to do calligraphy letters. Which I thought was really cool because um, with some of the art projects that I'm doing, being able to freehand write things um, will totally come in handy for me to be able to practice. Um, last two things. These are note folders. Um, they, they open up. They're plastic. They're pretty heavy duty plastic. But um, this has the constellations on it. It is so pretty. Um, it's hard to really see it. But um, this one has, it says notes. But when you look at it, you can almost see in that glare a little bit. Um, when you're looking at it, it looks like you're looking into it. It looks 3D. But I thought this would be really cool to use at um, work. Be able to put, you know, papers that I need to work on tomorrow or papers that, you know, I've already worked on that I'm waiting on responses for or something like that. Um, and then the last thing I got, you know that I love the beach. You know that I love turtles. If not, you will soon learn from being on my page. Um... But this is a color book. Look at that gorgeous turtle. Gorgeous. Um, there is all kinds of scenes in here. Like, look at that. Look at the wine and the fruit basket. And then this one's like aloe plants and cactuses. Gorgeous, gorgeous book. Has all kinds of things that you can color. Um, for a dollar, you can't beat this. Um, so I got that. And that's really it, my friends. It was so good to see you. It was so good to get on here and do another video. I'm really enjoying doing this. Um, hopefully, I can, you know, get my page looking a little better. I've added a banner and some things to it. I'm trying to figure out now how you do um, the thumbnails because I'm not really, <laughs> I'm not really um, up to date with that sort of stuff. Um, so I've been just trying to Google and see what I need to do because um, I, I just I'm having fun doing this. I, I love to shop at Dollar Tree. I'm going to shop at the Dollar Tree. So why not? Why not do this? It's fun. Um, so again, thank you for coming to my page. Subscribe. Subscribe if you haven't. Um, I promise to get better at this. I promise to uh, do more videos. I'm going to start doing some good Goodwill hauls um, because I love to thrift. Maybe even doing some... Um, projects art projects that um y'all can see so anyways thank you for coming and um i hope that you made it at least halfway through this video um again so um thank you and good night